Okay, you all. A while back, I showed you Neil Gaiman's um, official coloring book. It's the one I did a picture in it of Coraline. Um, anyway, he's one of my favorite authors. He writes crazy, wacky stories, and this is his New York's best selling, the official coloring book, American Gods. That was a series. This is done out by a branch of HarperCollins. This was a series done on HBO, or not HBO, excuse me, Stars. I have only watched one or two episodes of it so far, so I can't comment on this, but um, I'm not sure if this book is following the series. I'm assuming it's following the story. Yes, obviously. Really cool illustrations. They end up being one-sided. Paper thickness is about an 80 pound. Um, and then there's text on the back side of every page. But if you put router protection through, you could use whatever you wanted as far as media goes. Some really cool illustrations in here. You can tell it's done by different illustrators as you can see different styles. See? Anyhow, some cool illustrations in it. People, a lot of people illustrations. Here's Laura laying with her eyes closed. This looks like it was done by a different illustrator too. As well as this. I find that fun to pick those out, but not necessary, is it, I guess. A lot of details. Cool pick. This is following the series pretty close. So if I don't see the old guy in it. Oh, there he is. Mr. Ibis. Lady Liberty. Really cool. As you can tell by the um, pictures it's a real fantasy related story if you have premium channels you can watch it on stars he's a fantasy writer he writes all kinds of crazy stories one of my favorite movies of all time is it's a stop animation film called Coraline and that was his story a little girl who has another family they have buttons for eyes So when I saw you had this out, I had to have it. Different illustrator. A lot of details. Wow, this one would be tough coloring, wouldn't it? Be beautiful though. Different illustrator. Cool pick though. Cool book, don't you think? And I'm 
the pages would tear out very easily, I see. I don't believe they're perforated. Some really cool images, though. That'd be beautiful, done. Who doesn't have a woman in the trunk of their car? Postscript. There's the lucky chipped eyeball. Okay, they're about the author. That's Neil. And then there's three different artists in this book. Yep, I had that figured out. Yvonne Gilbert, Craig Phillips, and John Proctor. Anyways, the war has begun and nobody saw it. This is the official coloring book, American Gods. Thanks, y'all.